Well, Dom, welcome to Liverpool. Thank you. How does it feel to be one of our players? Yeah, it feels amazing. Everyone's made me feel very welcome already. Um, even just putting on the training top, yeah, I was over the moon. So hopefully I can put on their shirt in the near future and yeah, make some good uh, history. Uh, obviously, you arrive here as a World Cup winner as well. It's been a magnificent summer for you, this, hasn't it? Yeah, definitely. The World Cup was a um, fantastic achievement um, out in Korea. Um, we knew if we went out and um, done well, then we knew we got a good bunch of boys. So um, to win it was amazing. Did you have that feeling before you went out that this could be something special for, for you as a team? Yeah, I think so, because we've always done well. And we won the under-17 Euros and um, got to the semi-final in the under-19 Euros. So um, we knew if we um, all played well and um, was all on our game, then we'd have a really good chance. Confidence is so big in football, isn't it, to have done that in the summer and then to arrive at a new club must be must be huge for you. Yeah, definitely. It's definitely a, a very big confidence booster for me. And um, yeah, winning that tournament could only help my confidence, as you say. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to getting started. And individually, did you feel you had a, a point to prove out in South Korea? Yeah, definitely. I didn't really play much football last season. So for me to get some minutes on the, on the pitch and um, get some game time was really good. Individually as well, named player of the tournament. How yeah. did that feel? Yeah, that was amazing. Um, when the final whistle went uh, in the final, I was so happy that we, we won it. And then um, as I was lining up to get the team trophy, I got told that um, I won the golden ball as well. So um, my mood just took off again after that. So yeah, it was a good achievement. It's nothing new to you because you, you are, and, and people will track your, your progress and your history as well, know that you, you're well used to winning trophies, both individually and as a team player as well. As, is this something that can gather momentum, you hope, now at Liverpool as well? Yeah, definitely. Um, I've always been a born when I wanted to win, win everything that I can. So, um, yeah, winning the team uh, trophies and individual trophies uh, during my career so far has, has helped me a lot. Tell us a little bit about you prior to, to that tournament then. In terms of your position, you've played as a traditional striker, you've played in those support roles as well. Where do you feel most comfortable? Where is, where is your chosen position, if you like? My favourite position will probably be the striker, number nine. and. Um, but I can play behind the striker in a 10 position or out wide. So, um, yeah, I think I'm quite versatile. And reaching this decision to come to Liverpool, how did, you, how did you come to that? Why was this the club for you? I just, every time I watch Liverpool, I see there's such a family nature and um, a lot of young players doing well at the club. So um, I think it'll be a good place for me to uh, develop my career. People will have done their the history and their research on you as well. You, you once tweeted in 2012 how much you loved Anfield and, <laughs> and how you thought the fans were brilliant as well. Can you, can you remember tweeting that? Um, not really until I, I saw a few notifications of people tweeting it back to me. And um, yeah, it, was, <laughs> it looked like some of the fans liked it. But um, no, nah, Anfield is an amazing stadium, so I can't wait to uh, experience that. You will be one of them very soon. The Scousers will, will tell you what they, they think about this great club as well. You, you allude to it there, the atmosphere at, at Anfield, those, those famous European nights. Are you really looking forward to being part of all of that? Yeah, definitely. Um, when you see it on TV, you can, you can get a bit of the atmosphere from there. So to actually be, be there in the stadium, I can't imagine what it's going to be like. You spoke a little bit there about your decision to join Liverpool as well. When you see the young players like they did breaking through last season and making headlines for themselves, does that play a big part in, in that process? Yeah, definitely. As a young player, you always want to see um, the club you're at uh, pushing through their young players and um, hoping that you can do the same. So, yeah, definitely. Because your paths will have crossed with so many of these players as well, won't they? Do you know any of them personally? Do you, are you in touch with any of them? Yeah, I'm quite friend, good, uh, good friends with Joe Gomez, known him from, from quite uh, young. And um, obviously, Ovie and uh, Shea that was just um, was with us at the World Cup. So, yeah, I know a couple of them. And what kind of talent do you think we have coming through here? Are you optimistic that there could be a bright future for all of those players you mentioned? Yeah, definitely. I think um, Liverpool's got a lot of good, good young players, so hopefully um, everyone can play their part. Ovier and, and Shea, were they telling you about Liverpool when you, when you were away with them? <laughs> yeah, we spoke a bit and um, yeah, they've just got good things to say, so I'm looking forward to uh, enjoying it with them. I'm sure Jurgen Klopp plays a big part in it as well. You'd have watched him from a distance last season as well. How much are you looking forward to? How excited are you to be one of his players? Yeah, so excited. Um, every time I've seen him, he's always so enthusiastic and passionate. So, and I think that's what you need as a manager. So I'm really looking forward to working with him. And also great strikers at the club as well. Are you, are you looking forward to improving? You're a young player. You've done so much 
so far already, but I'm sure you feel you can improve and, and the manager can help you do that. Yeah, definitely. As a young player, that's, that's all you want to do is try and reach your full potential. So um, to have good players around you and a good manager to help, that will be really good. I know you won't tell us about targets in terms of how many goals you want to score next <laughs> season, but are there, are there short-term objectives that you have arriving here at Liverpool? Um, I just want to make an impact, really. Hopefully, um, when I get my opportunity, I can take it and help the team. And you walk past the European Cup there as well to be part of a team that is back hopefully long-term in the Champions League as well. Yeah. That is an exciting prospect, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. Um, that's where all the clubs want to reach and um, play, so to be a part of that will be good for everyone. And you're hopeful as well Liverpool will challenge domestically. You wouldn't have joined the club, would you, if you didn't think that they had really lofty ambitions going forward? No, exactly. Um, I do think uh, everything's really promising. There's a good bunch of players, good managing staff, as we said, and um, yeah, I think that um, can do well. It's great to meet up with you and good luck in the future. Before I let you would have said I'm fine If you ask, if you ask, if you ask me And then you gave that word another